Tom Brady. I don't know if you made the surprise because he's all the way down at three. But a, a guy now who you know doesn't have that dominant presence of a wide receiver, but he's still distributing the ball to guys like Danny Woodhead. Wes Walker's still part of it. You know, Deion Branch has been a part of it. Tom Brady's doing a lot of the line of scrimmage, getting young tight ends involved. So very, very impressive. And number two, I, I thought long and hard about this, but Philip Rivers, another guy, maybe, maybe doing more with less than anybody in the National Football League. I mean, you know, Antonio Gates to this time, he's still been phenomenal. Just on face, look at that. 19 interceptions, or 19 touchdowns at this point, only eight interceptions. Carrying his football team, he's got no run game, really has no established wide receiver, has been tremendous. And at number one, Peyton Manning. And I thought long and hard about Philip Rivers at number one, but Peyton Manning at the line of scrimmage does so much getting his team into the right situation. And then again, talk about a guy that's playing with banged up, uh, or playing with, you know, basically reserved. Jacob Tammy at tight end. Austin Collins missed a ton of time. Pierre Garçon has missed a ton of time. Really doing it with guys that, that no one knows about. And so, uh, at this point, I'd have to put Peyton Manning number one. Brady and Manning this Sunday in Foxborough. Should be a great one. Thank you, Tim.